Welcome to your tutorial on setting up and managing transfers in the Addition Financial Digital Banking Experience. In this walkthrough, we'll be exploring all of the options available for making transfers using your Addition Financial account. The digital banking system allows you to set up one-time and recurring transfers from your Addition Financial accounts and make Addition Financial loan payments through the transfer feature. New Transfers To make a new transfer, navigate to the Make a Transfer tab in the navigation bar at the top of the screen. This will take you directly to the new transfer page. To choose the account you want to transfer from, click Select Account in the From drop-down menu. Then select the account you want to transfer money to in the To drop-down menu. You may select Internal, External, or Member-to-Member -member accounts from this drop-down. Or select the loan you would like to make a payment to. We'll cover how to set up external accounts later on in this tutorial. Enter the amount you would like to transfer, and be sure to add the decimal point. Next, select the frequency that you would like to make this transfer by either choosing Now to send funds immediately, or choose Scheduled to select from a variety of transfer timing options, including one time, weekly, every two weeks, monthly, quarterly, and annual. Then select the date you wish to initiate your transfer. Enter a memo to describe the transfer as needed. Once you're satisfied with your transfer, click Review to be taken to the Review Transfer screen. From here, you can confirm your transfer details cancel your transfer, or select Edit to return to the previous screen and make changes if needed. Click Confirm when satisfied to be taken to the confirmation screen. You should see a blue check mark in the top left corner and a short animation will play. From this page, you may also select Start another transfer to set up a new transfer. Scheduled Transfers The Scheduled Transfers tab displays a list of pending transfers. The list shows both one-time and recurring transfers. Use the search bar to locate specific transfers. You may also filter the search results by date, amount, account, and time span. To edit a scheduled transfer, click the transfer you wish to change to open it, then click the Edit Transfer button. From here, you can edit the amount and the starts on date. When satisfied with your transfer, click Save Changes. For recurring payments, additional options to cancel your next payment and delete scheduled transfer will appear. Transfer History The third section in the Transfers menu is Transfer History. This tab displays a list of your completed transfers. You can use the search bar to locate specific transactions or use the Sort and Filter feature to find your transfer by date, amount, or time span. External Accounts the External Account section enables you to add and manage external accounts used for transfers to and from Addition Financial. The Manage tab opens by default and shows you your existing linked external accounts. Details like the name of the account, last four digits of the account number, status of the account, and account type are displayed. By clicking on an external account, you will see a brief account summary. From here, you may choose to edit the account nickname by clicking the pencil icon to the right of the existing nickname. You also now have easy access to the routing number. You may also choose to delete an added external account from here. To add a new external account, click the Add Account tab, read through the External Transfers Disclosure, and then click Accept and Continue. This will prompt a security validation. You may choose either an instant account verification or manual account input. For this tutorial, we'll be using an instant account verification. To move forward with adding the external account, click Get Started. Select the financial institution you would like to add from the list. If you don't see your chosen institution, use the search bar to find it, then click Continue. Depending on your financial institution, the system will either display a screen for your login credentials or an initial disclosure on the information needed to link the accounts. You may also be asked for MFA information required by the external financial institution. A single sign-on, SSO pop-up window may also display to enter the required information. Enter the required information and click Submit. 
If the credentials are verified, a list of accounts from the external financial institution will display. You may use these accounts for external transfers. Select the accounts you want to use and click Confirm. Your external accounts will then be available to use immediately. If for any reason you are having trouble logging in using instant account verification, the option to input your external account information manually is available. You may also add an external account using the new transfer tab, which follows the same process. Thank you for watching.